Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So we're going to be doing a walkthrough uh, of Act 8, Chapter 2, Quest Number 4, Looking Glass. All right, so you see the team that I'm going in here with, uh, and we're going to do what I consider the easiest path, okay? And it's this one here that starts with Civil Warrior, all right? Now, the reason why... I think this path is the easiest, uh, and we'll see it in a moment here, is because of life transfer. All right, invade, ignore invade, all right? Invade is nice, uh, it'll help you, you can hit into their block, do more damage, but look at that heavy assault, okay? Heavy assault um, will give you a lot more damage uh, if you do your heavies, and then you have life transfer. Okay, life transfer is going to help you heal up. It's very forgiving. Okay, and you got Langer, of course, and you've got um, uh, Transducer. All right, those you don't really have to worry about uh, those, but this path is pretty easy. Okay, and you can do it with uh, any champion at all. Okay, just look at look at my health. Okay, now. Because of the heavy assault, if you have champions that do really powerful heavy attacks, they might do a little bit better because you'll do a little bit more damage. Okay, but just look at this. Look at this. I'm losing health, right? But with every hit, I'm healing it back up. That's life transfer. Okay, so even if you mess up, as long as it doesn't kill you and they don't turtle up, you're doing great, okay? So I am using Hercules just because he's fun and because I haven't been using him a whole lot. And he basically has a nice heavy. And you're going to see um, some of his power because I mess up in uh, one of these fights. All right, so look at that. We finished with full health. Beautiful, 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 okay? But... We, we actually do mess up, and that is like the perfect example of why I like this path. And as you can see, we're not dealing with strong defenders either. So pretty much any of these guys can do this. But I wanted to get through this pretty quickly, and Herc does a very, very good job. Uh, I can ramp him up, <clears throat> and um, he just gets faster and faster. Okay, um, but you'll notice I'm getting hit into my block and because of that invade, they're doing a lot of damage. So you're going to take a lot of block damage if you block a lot, but life transfer, you heal it right back up. Okay, so really nice. Look, look at his health. And thankfully, he's not getting anything. He's not healing up. So we're really doing well. And look at the look at the damage his heavy attacks are doing because of that heavy assault all right now see that was a really nice um special too right but look at my heavy my heavy's doing more more right so do your heavy attacks um especially if you bring in somebody that does uh really strong heavies if you have a ranked up um captain america infinity war bring them wasp bringer very very strong okay now you see that i brought ghost but she doesn't really have a very strong heavy but i brought her just you know because i'm gonna have some fun with ghost okay there used to be a time where i brought ghost so much that people got bored and they were like oh oh man what if you don't have ghost well and so i haven't been using her a whole lot and I don't want that to happen with Hercules, which is why you didn't see me using him a lot in the previous videos. Because um, I don't want people to be like, yes, yes, we know Herc is good, but what about the other champs? Well, on this path, bring whoever you like. You can do it with anybody. I, I didn't see, bring, bring counters. Whoever you know you can beat these defenders with, you can bring them. Okay, you know, I forgot about the auto block here. 
with him. So then he punished me, but that's cool because I'm going to heal it right on back up. Okay, but look at, look at that damage. That's Invade doing that. Uh-oh, look at that. Immortality, but guess what? I'm healing back up. Hey, and I got hit, but what do you know? I'm healing it back up. And then fire off my special three. So even though I messed up big time, that life transfer meant I'm not sitting there at that little 1% health. Just look at this. Look at this. Look at my health. That special three, bam, I'm back. Back, baby. And now, because he made me mad, I'm just whooping on him. No more special, unless it's a special three. But as you can see, that life transfer can be a lifesaver. Very, very easy uh, path, indeed. There we go. No special two. Just finish him off. Because we don't have any more immortality. So if he, he got us again, then that would have been it. But look at that. Messed up big time and still managed to get it done. Very, very quick. Um, let me see. This one, I think, was... Um, yeah. Yeah. Um, I remember, because uh, at this point in time, I've already uh, fully explored this particular uh, quest. Um, but yeah, Iceman is nasty. And that's why I brought in uh, Ghost. Because she phased out his cold snap. Just like that. And then he went unstoppable. I went, whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy now. Because he did a heavy attack. And I'm like, okay, look at that. I'm like, okay, so that's how we doing it. That's how we doing it today. You know? We're just going to fire heavies off. But that's cool. I don't care. Because Ghost is cool. Ghost got it. Look at that. We don't care. Do this thing. Come on, ghost. It's been a while. So we ain't scared. Now, if you don't know, Iceman got a buff. Iceman good now. People are taking Iceman to rank four and five now. So, yeah, Iceman good now. In case you've, you've been away from the game for a little bit. All right. Look at this. So there's my heavy, which doesn't do a whole lot of damage, but that's cool. Look at that. He's just doing them heavy attacks. Look at that. Look at that. What you trying to do, bro? What's all that? You ain't. You are not Mysterio. Look at that. Just a couple hits. She back to full. So it took a little bit longer, but look at this. Hit him with it. He got that ice armor up, but it didn't help him all that much. Look at that. Invade. Woo! But she's back to full. So, yeah. Having done all of these paths, this one is still what I consider the easiest path out of all of them. So, if you're doing a completion, choose this path and have a fun time. Easy. Easy. All right. Very forgiving. And don't feel bad if you die or anything like that. But it is a very forgiving uh, path. Let me see. Next up. Yeah. Now, we can't use Ghost for this. Because Hulkbuster also got a buff. And it's funny. They gave him a buff that made him an anti-Ghost counter. Because he puts on armor breaks like crazy. He don't even have to hit you. Isn't that fun? Shut Ghost down. Just like that. They ain't slick. That's a that's a nerf. Okay, that's a nerf to Ghost. But you don't have to touch the champion to nerf him. We got you. He's seeing you. All right. So here's a guy that I am considering for rank five. He is a beast. Okay. He is a straight beast. And I am definitely considering him uh, for rank five. Look at that damage. Okay. We're just trying to bait that out. All right. There we go. Get that health back. Mm-hmm. I would like to get some um, pierces, but he don't want to play right. 
You know, Hulk Buster is just chilling. It's like, oh, you want to hit my block? Okay, well, then I won't block. Unless I have uh, specials and you want to bait that out, then I'll block. And not throw my special. So I just said, fine. Okay, there we go. Now we got our um, pierces. So now we can do some damage. Yeah. Here we are. Look at that damage. Mmm. Nasty. I can't remember if I did any heavy attacks with him. I don't think he has really strong heavies. All right, there goes some uh, Pierce. Do it. That's not going to finish him. Now he's got that self-repair. Okay, let's do it again. Look at this. Lovely. Especially because I'm running the ouchy masteries. I love life transfer because I can basically play fire specials to my heart's content and not really worry about it. And it is a nice, what I call an item saving path. All right, we're getting close to it. And if I remember correctly, yeah, we had to deal with this guy here. Um, Black Panther Civil War can be really, really annoying. You have to remember not to hit or rather not to stun him when he has the reflective stun armor ups. Don't do it. It will not look good for you. Won't work out well. See, he starts with reflective armor, but you see I was able to parry him because he has no armor ups. All right, so I'm just trying to get in as much damage. Okay, now, can't parry. Can't stun him. Okay, so there we go. Baited out a heavy attack, which is unstoppable, but he has such a multi-hit heavy like that, the unstoppable wears out before um, his heavy is over, so it's easy to punish him. And his specials are, are pretty easy. Okay, don't bother trying to armor break him. Um... You can just play around it. As you can see here. Bam! Right in his nose. Skadoosh! Now this is nice. My stun does not reflect when it's a... Uh, I think it's a passive stun uh, on the uh, special two. So I didn't get reflectively stunned there. Very nice. Very quick. Very easy. But... He's an older champion, so I remember how to fight him. Okay. I believe that is the path. Yeah. Now, we're going to get to the boss, and I'm going to show you the boss that I consider uh, the easier boss. Now, you might get a hint of who it is by seeing who I bring in. Because I'm always going to bring in somebody for the boss, even if I don't use them. Because I sometimes like to have fun and, and play around with some of my other uh, champions. So I'm thinking about here because there are a few counters that I could bring in. Okay. Uh, so I'm thinking about it. And uh, you see that Elsa? I love me some Elsa. And I actually have a newfound love for Omega Sentinel. More on that later. All right. So I'm like, yeah, who am I taking out? Bam. Okay. Now, look at this. And guess who we're going to go in? Morningstar. Now, when you hit Morningstar, you're going to get bleeds on you. But guess who loves debuffs? Guess who can convert debuffs into Furies? All right. And you've got all of these nodes here. But with Ghost, you really don't have to worry about it. Now you see why I, I wanted to bring in Elsa. Because when Elsa is bled, she does a degen. So my thought process was, and, and you also have the Caltrops. Okay. So be careful about that. Uh, if you want. Just bring in a Bleed Immune Champion, and you should be okay. Okay? Play around the nodes, but that's fine. Ghost can do this fight, but I get caught 
by the nodes, okay? So, look at that. Look how fast she was able to recover and block that. Isn't that fun? All right, anyway. There we go. Look at this. And you, all you have to do is this. Okay, you don't really have to fire any specials if you don't want to. In fact, I would recommend not firing specials. Um, because it can get you good. But I get impatient and I don't like, you know. But watch this. Bam. Okay, so what happened? You have to be very careful. Look at the, um, the debuffs that you had on you. I forget what they're called. But if you're using Ghost, make sure you're phased with um, Hood Synergy when that goes down. And then you're fine. Now, what happened right there? I was just getting smacked up. I don't know. But yeah, she's getting degen, but I noticed something. The degen is not really doing a whole lot. Look at this. That's not a lot of degen damage. And the bleed is really doing some damage. And then you can see here, um, it's it's ticking down. My time is about to go. And she's doing some good damage, and she goes down. And I'm like, man. Now, I could bring in Ghost and, and finish it off if I want to. But I'm, of course, stubborn. And I'm like, let's go through my other champions. Remember I said Wasp? She has a strong heavy attack, right? Y'all think Wasp is just, you know, a little cute bug. No. Wasp good. I like Wasp. Look at Wasp. Bam. Bam. Look at that damage. Now, she's not going to last. But we can do some damage. Okay. So, that's fine. Like I said, bring in a bleed immune. <coughs> that's going to be your best bet. But... We do have one other person left. Hood. So let's see what Hood does. Hey. Hood staggering. Hood looking nice. What's this? Uh-oh. And now the bleeds. Hood's not bleed immune. But I want to hurt... Um, Morningstar as much as possible because we know who's going to finish it off, right? Look at that. But he did a little damage before he went down and, and went to sleep. So now we come to finishing it off. Just because I didn't want to use a revive. Now, with Hercules, of course, um, if I remember right, he has a bleed resistance. And also... He's Hercules. Look at that. I got smacked up. Look at that. All that health, gone. But you know what? I don't care. Hit her with it. Finished. All right. So that's going to do it, guys. Um, I do think Morningstar is uh, one of the easier bosses. But I think I went... <sighs> trying to remember... Um, I don't think I, I went against her uh, for the repeat. Yeah. Uh, Masakri. He, I think, is actually easier than Morningstar. Uh, I didn't find him difficult at all. Uh, Ghost could do it. Hercules could do it. I got solos on him without too much difficulty. So uh, if you're doing the completion, you can either bring a bleed immune you could do it with Ghost uh, and, and do Morningstar or go for the Masakri. And he's probably going to be easier. All right. Anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.